Money TV. Y'all need to fuck with my man, bro, because if y'all don't fuck with him, then I don't fuck with y'all. Hey, hey little nigga, talk to you for a real quick. Hey, Remy, talk to him, nigga. Hey, hey let me talk to him. Yeah. Bound My Money TV, it's your boy King Chaos, man. We back. Welcome back to the Good Guy Gang, man. Welcome back to the Money Gang. Y'all know who y'all are. We in the building. Free my dog Hennessy to my dog Hennessy Free. What's up with y'all out there in battle rap? Y'all know how we doing. We talking battle rap today. You know, that's my favorite subject. We do do hip-hop business, all that. BMM, business, music, and money management. But today, it's bars, metaphors, and microphones. Man, we got to talk a little bit about this hit man bags and bodies man if you've been under a rock if you don't know what's going on of course hit man is a battle rap legend from the midwest y'all know i represent the midwest wilding out you know trucking companies i mean he has done probably probably one of the most successful battle rappers uh him and charlie clips and you know conceded just what they did outside of battle rap has been amazing so out of those three hitman has decided to start a league but before he starts his league and this is a, this is a breakdown so i'm so i'm gonna I'm reverse a little bit hitman gets on twitter he gets on his social media and, and he says he's having a show the show is going to be based around battle rap he's going to have all the battle rappers in one house like a reality show and they're going to have to compete in different things in order to win a hundred thousand dollars a hundred that y'all know i love stuff like that we i mean we talking business we talking battle rap and we talking tournaments you know tournaments have been having battle rap turned up so all three of those things run ran into one and ran by hitman who's one of my favorites out of the midwest is is fire i think this is something that's gonna be crazy he said he uh him and vixen been, have been going live you can check out their lives they've been in spaces they've been everywhere talking about it people put in uh audition tapes that have you know that you know um he even had uh open auditions all different kind of places and i'm gonna pull my phone out a minute we're gonna Damn, let me get my phone. He had tryouts in all different locations. Let's try to see if I can't find, find see where his man was at with these trials. But as I'm doing that, so like I said, giving back in this way is fire, man. I love to see battle rappers getting involved in the business size and, and taking control of the culture that is theirs, man. So let's check out Hit man. So basically he went around. He wanted to he wanted to kind of mix it up. People you people we knew like mid tiers, um, you know, a couple people that you some people might consider top tiers and he really wanted to bring in some new people. And he also got ladies. The ladies, it's uh, four ladies right now battling for their spot. I think that's going to go down on September 29th. It's, it's dope, but he had open auditions all across the U.S., you know, different different cities. See, I'm scrolling through his uh, Twitter, she... People were making audition tapes. I mean, it was crazy, I man. It was dope how he did it. Had the audition tapes, had the ladies uh, spitting bars. So I thought that was pretty dope. But um, he had New York auditions. He had four, four city auditions. Uh, ATL, New York. Chicago, St. Louis, and we went to all those different cities, man, and had open auditions, man. I thought that was fire to try to get, you know, some new talent, some people we may have never seen before, so I think that that's fire in and of itself, so Houston, 
I'm just looking through, man. He went so many different places, man, just to try to get a cross as of talent from so many different areas, man. So open auditions in all those different cities. Um, like I said, he partnered up with Vixen. Vixen helping, you know, pick and come up with ideas about. It. I think that's that's really dope. So, all right, it was. I just these are the official ones. The auditions was in Houston, New York, Los Angeles, and St. Louis. So Houston, New York, Los Angeles, and St. Louis. So he had. Four open auditions for new, up and cover, whoever you get to the auditions. People who were already pretty known, they had a voting system, they sent in tapes. People were auditioning in all kind of different ways. Uh, then he had the last final ladies. They gonna be fighting for a single spot. Um, Rock Lee, Hope Trilly, uh, and let me see. Okay, the ladies was Fendi, Ash Cash, Rock Lee, and Hope Trilly. So they battling it out. They sent in audition tapes. It's been fire. It's been having the culture and the uproar. It's been dope because he's offering $100,000. And he says that he's going to be doing a, a probably trying to do a league of his own after that. I think that's dope. I think it's dope for uh those guys who don't always get the big recognition to be able to be a part of it and some new guys and some new young ladies. So, Hitman, salute to you for putting that together, man. I'm going to put up on the screen uh, the guys that's in it, and we're going to read through these names so we can get familiar with the people who made it. To uh, We're going to get familiar with the people who made it on Bags and Bodies with Hitman Holla. Let's see here. First and foremost is my guy. Now, this is when I say you don't have to be a, a new guy. Uh, Mac Myron has been up there on the top of my list, uh, one of the people who've been putting crazy work. Again, he's from the Midwest. So salute Mac Myron for making it in Bags and Bodies. Snake Eyes made it on Bags and Bodies. Definitely deserve it. Snake Eyes definitely been putting in that good work this year. Midnight Madness, winning the belt, all the things he's done been fire. J2, J2 uh, is coming off a, a crazy two-on-two. -two. Um, beat Prestavia on uh, Remy Miles League, Chrome 23. Definitely been having a crazy year. Deserves to be in the house. A lot of personality. And all these guys I'm naming, man, Mac Myron, crazy personality. Funny dude. I know he's going to be good for the, for the house. Snake Eyes definitely can stir up some controversy. He has some of the best face-offs in battle rap. J2, we we just talked about uh, MVP. MVP was runner-up in the URM tournament. The, um, the real name, Brandon, won. He's from St. Louis. Definitely a force to be reckoned with. I wish I would have been seeing him more on the URL, but it's dope that he got into the Hitman Hollow uh, house and he can try his luck at winning this 100000 Prestavia. Now, when we say Prestavia, that's the first lady of gun titles. You got Sue Surf. You got Easy the Block Captain. You got you got uh, Chess. You got Tay Rock. You got guys like that that's backing you. It's definitely, definitely a leg up for you. So Prestavia, you know, out of all these names, as a lady, I think she definitely belongs in that house and definitely going to bring us bars. Um she has a good chance of winning, man. She definitely is a puncher, and she can stand in there with the guys. Eon. Eon is another up-and-coming young lady. Y'all going to be hearing so much more about Eon. Um, Eon been doing her thing for a while. She's from uh, Chicago, if I'm not mistaken. She's from the Shy. Uh, managed by my guy, Mike Extreme. Salute Mike Extreme from down here in Nap. So Midwest Connection, I hope Eon does well. She definitely got my vote when they was asking what new female should be in the uh, in the house. Bad News, what, what can we say about Bad News? If you watch Battle Rap, you know who Bad News is. Bad News was one of uh, John John's hitters in the um, bullpen. So you know Bad News is coming to rap, and he has a crazy personality. I can see him getting in conflict with somebody in this house. So it's dope. This this list so far is dope, and I can 
I can really see each and every one of these uh, people that I just named going far inside of there. Pause inside the tournament, and you know, I'll be tripping. After bad news, you got Banks the guy. Banks the guy is probably a newer dude I'm not not too familiar with. Um, Cali Smooth. Cali Smooth is nice. Cali Smooth come from uh, uh, West Coast. Of course, with the name like Cali, I seen him on the ride. He can definitely spit another good addition to the house. And he has a good, funny dude, great character. So he'll do well inside. A house like bags and body because you know it's, it's it's about battle rap it's about making music but it's also a reality show so your your charisma your attitude the person who you are you know how you speak all those things come across so i think it's dope let's see pg they call him PG, Poetic Genius is his name. Not not too familiar with uh, PG, but I'm sure he do well, you know, if uh, Hitman picked him to be in the house. KD, if y'all watch any ever watch my uh, intro, KD is one of the guys that I uh, interviewed early, early on. When you watch the info, intro, KD is on my intro. Yo, Bull Peanut, he's another new guy, up-and-comer that I haven't heard of, so I don't have I don't have much to say about it. I don't know him, but good luck. B Mac. B Mac is from St. Louis. I had the pleasure of, of interviewing B Mac. So if you look into some of the old content that we got on the channel, my guy B Mac is on there. Good dude. Good attitude. He went crazy when he was here and had his battle. So go check out B Mac. Jers. Jers, I haven't sure heard of, but I'm sure he sure he's dope. YK Soup, never heard of YK Soup, but hey, he's in the house. Good luck to him. Forte Dev, Forte Dev been on a ride. Forte Dev has had uh, been on uh, RBE. Dev can rap. Dev got great personality. He did a funny skit uh, to get himself in the house. So I, I, I'm hoping Forte Dev go. Go for in a tournament. Good luck to Forte. He also battled my guy, uh, uh, True Foe. So Forte Dev has had some competition, so he should be able to do well in the tournament. J that guy. I'm not familiar with J that guy. Probably one of the newer guys that um, Hitman picked up in the tournament, so that's dope. Then you got Coach Court. Corleone, Coach Corleone is one of the new bricks. He's also from Chicago. Coach is 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 a hey, coach can put bars together. He he can put that bully style on you. You know he got that Chicago swag about himself. Gonna be a formidable opponent in there. Good, good luck to Coach. That's also one of my guys from the Midwest. So you know I'm rooting for you. Yogi the God. I'm not. I'm not too familiar with i can't say i've heard his name before but i've never watched him battle so good luck ej and roscoe wells both newer guys that I, i'm not you know i'm not sure sure of but that's the list of everybody that was picked for bags and bodies stay on the lookout go back and uh vote for those ladies that gotta battle their way into the house ash cash rock lee Fendi and Hope Trilly. So go vote for the ladies. Go watch their audition tapes and be and be on the lookout for their battles because it's going to be crazy. Those ladies are hungry and I'm sure they're going to put in work to get in that house for that 100000 What do y'all think though, man? What do y'all think about Hitman coming back and giving back to a battle rap like this? What do you think about the format of the show? Do you like them battle? Do you want to see them just battle? Do you want to see them like make songs? What do you want to see on Bags and Bodies? And what do y'all think about Hitman giving the ladies and, the, and gentlemen this opportunity? 
I just wanted, like I said, come and get y'all opinion, go over it with y'all, because I love when battlers are, are making moves inside of battle rap and doing stuff outside of just rapping, getting involved in the business and getting involved with getting other people in battle rap. So I think that's fire to me. So let me know what y'all think, man. Make sure y'all hitting that like. Make sure y'all hitting that, sh that subscribe button. And when you hit the subscribe button, you're hitting all the post notification bell to all. So when I drop dope content, man, y'all can pop right in and, and support your boy. Uh, salute to the money gang. Salute to the good guy gang. Make sure you visit the website and cop the merch. And if you watched the last video, man, my fault on the audio. I don't know what was going on, but we got it straight for this one. All right. What the business is. About my money TV is your boy. TV. Oh, my money TV. Money. Go so subscribe to this channel right now. Like this channel that you own. Click about my money TV. It's your boy King Chaos Man, and we back. About my money TV. It's your boy King Chaos Man. We back in the building, man. About my money TV. About my money TV. That's right. About my money TV, King Chaos. We out here in the. Yeah. I'm gonna pull up in that right phone. Pull up, yeah.